here in Mount Washington, potential sewer replacement up about a hundred foot uh, driveway. Property set back on the uh, structure set back on the property. We have a potential of a 65 foot pipe bursting pool to replace sewer from that tree down through this driveway into this pit. While excavating, we realize <clears throat> we have this gas pipe, what looks to be a gas pipe, right on top of our clay sewer pipe, as you can see there. This is cut now after some due diligence and some research. Um, as soon as we saw this gas pipe that Danny found, during excavation, we realized we have a potential issue here. <clears throat> now, if you can see, the gas pipe is so close to our sewer pipe, the head that the cable pulls through to pull a new pipe through, the old sewer pipe, uh, puts immense pressure on the earth around the pipe, which could possibly ruin, damage, break, whatever you want to call it, the gas pipe that's close to the sewer pipe. So. Uh, we decided to call the gas company to come check out their line, see what they got, call 811, have them mark their utilities to double check this gas line or what seemed to be a gas line. So they marked their utility lines here. Gas came, marked their utility lines. Identifiers yellow for gas lines always. White colored paint is a uh, proposed excavation site. Green is sewer, blue is water, and uh, red is usually electrical. Uh, telephone, electrical, what have you. <clears throat> so here's our, here's our other excavation point <clears throat> where we realized that that gas pipe over there continues also running along the top side of our sewer pipe here. Um, and it had a nipple and a cap that after the gas company came and could not identify this as their active gas pipe, I decided to go ahead and shut the water main off just in case this was a water main pipe and unscrew this nipple and cap out of this pipe. Um, this is a major step in uh, making sure that nothing was gonna get broken or damaged during the trenchless pipe bursting uh, replacement. Ends up being a dead, non-active gas pipe um, so now that we knocked out that possibility of it being a live gas pipe or water pipe We now again have the green light to go ahead with the pipe bursting and replace the 65 feet of sewer pipe <clears throat> This is a prime example of due diligence and uh, safety precautions and uh, Also a prime example of what pipe bursting will allow you to prevent including trenching, jackhammering, any hardscape of a property. Um, without this technology, we are literally trenching and cutting and demoing this entire strip of concrete, uh, maybe some rocks, some stairs, stuff like that, to manually replace the sewer pipe. So technology advancement is at play here. And uh, this is just a really good example and also great learning experience for the learning curve of uh, plumbing in the plumbing world. This is the Drain Whisperer, Los Angeles, California. <clears throat>